Today we will be talking all about drones. Unmanned aerial vehicles are changing the way data is being captured on the construction job site. It is also changing the future of industrial work. One particular example comes from Kespri. This privately held company provides an integrated solution. It offers all the software, hardware, and data analysis tools that a construction company needs. Here to explain all about it is George Matthew, Chairman and CEO of Cuspri. George, welcome to the show. Great to be here. Thank you, Peggy. So, George, really let's start talking all about the basics. What really is a drone? Sure. So the best way to think about a drone is a flying robot, something that can very easily take the data that comes off of that robot itself on a more autonomous basis and be able to use that for all kinds of use cases. In the case of the construction industry, there's great information that comes from visual sensors that are on a drone that enable you to take high resolution imagery that let you understand how to do visual inspection of a work site that helps you understand volumetric analysis of assets that might be located on that work site and automatically deliver that in reports and applications to business users that need to make good decisions from data coming off of a work site. It seems all of a sudden, just recently, drones are, no pun intended, just taking off. It seems like mm -hmm. we've seen construction companies understanding the value now of what a drone can do. Why are we seeing construction companies finally getting to understand the real value that you just described? Well, I think construction companies have been working with drones for a few years now. They've been trying to understand where the use of this aerial intelligence platform that comes off of the drone could be used effectively for making great decisions within the context of a work site. I think what we've seen in the most recent years, and particularly with the last few years in specific, the aerial intelligence and the data is becoming more automated. It's more integrated into the work site. There's a great deal of telematics information that's actually coming off of equipment today. As you see heavy equipment on the ground on a construction site, that data is very valuable for understanding the maintenance of, say, for instance, that heavy equipment at any point. The data that's surrounding, say, for instance, the elevation, the grading of a work site, the earthworks projects that are typically underway before a full you know, build up on a construction site begins, the data point is actually quite valuable where drones are actually able to give you elevation, dimensionality, information that can be much more automated in terms of getting that data available to you versus taking, say, for instance, a GPS backpack and surveying that ground. And so we're seeing the evolution of how the drone itself is just an essential part of the next generation worksite itself. And most folks who have been in the construction industry for years have now had an opportunity to figure out where these parts and pieces fit effectively together, where the drone is now just a part of the way people work. So you see drones really changing the industrial work site right now and we're going to see a lot of that because you've just made a major announcement and alliance with John Deere. Let's talk a little bit about that. Yeah, so when you think about the work site itself, I had alluded to the fact that there's data that's always coming off the work site. Information from a telematic standpoint that might be coming from equipment. Information that's necessary to understand elevation and grading when it comes to an earthworks project. These are pieces of data that can be much more strongly integrated together as far as understanding where the status of various activities are continuing to evolve along a project on our worksite itself. Where we see the Caspery drone in particular being most essential is that you can automate all of these harder to repeat activities and get that in a reliable way delivered through an autonomous drone that's flying of course, collecting all the data that might be necessary, and then driving that information in a repeatable basis into applications that users can take advantage of. And so this is where we've seen a differentiator in the market to date for a solution like Caspery. And of course, that's where John Deere also saw that differentiator in the market. They can introduce this capability as a natural extension of the products and services that they're delivering to a worksite. Well, George, it's been great having you with us on Got a Tool, and I know we're going to have you come back on our next time that we have it so you can tell us more details. So we'll have like a part two of this. So uh, thank you so much, and there you have it. This is Got a Tool for today. Thank you.